really important part of painting is to actually prepare the surface. You're not using this process to do any filling or fairing. The surface is true, so then you can actually apply the thinnest possible amounts of primer and paint to the product. Sand the board right through to 240, um, and then finish it off at 320, and then you're ready for your top coat of paint. We use a two-part acrylic urethane paint. We've trialled many other different paints over the years and found this to be the best. It's hard enough wearing, but it's also got enough flexibility to not chip. This being a pro model, and the bottom gets sanded, the logo gets stenciled on. And then we apply a clear coat of urethane with a Teflon additive over top of that. We use this on the pro models because we're getting polished up and it makes a very hard wearing, non stick surface that just remains clean throughout its whole life. This is then once again baked again and then ready for the sanding and polishing. To polish the board, we start off with a thousand grips on a, a hard block, just hand sanding. And then we move on to a 1500 grit with a machine, an orbital, and then we move on to a 3000 grit, once again on an orbital. So now we've got a fully painted board ready for the opening up. This is where all the parts are previously inserted in the board and marked and pre-drilled, so they're ready to use. This is done using routers, laminate trimmers and drills and countersinks. We then file around all the thin boxes and the mast tracks. Foot pads are applied, and then put all the relevant stickers, fill in the data box. So then we install the Gore-Tex vent plug. It screws into an insert that's already been built into the board previously. Gore-Tex vent plug is great because it lets the board basically vent and equalise continually, and not just when you actually undo or do up a screw. So the final stage of building a board is to apply the non-skid or texture to the deck of the board. We use an acrylic urethane clear coat as an adhesive and a ground acrylic dust which is made from recycled acrylic lenses. The dust is sprinkled evenly over the deck and then a light amount of acrylic urethane sprayed over top of that. Now the board's finished, it's ready to be packed up and put in a box and sent direct to the customer.